so I'm going to get my character while we talk. Let me choose something that I can use because I have made so many characters at this point. So basically, I've been trying to come out with a video idea, but I can't seem to get my mind right on what I should do. So, basically, that's kind of where I've been, trying to get ideas. So, I'm just kind of confused on what I should do. I've actually done a lot better with my art lately. So, I might show you my sketchbook, but it might be a little bit personal, so... Some sketches I might choose not to show you, and some sketches are just horrid, and I don't like them either. I like looking back at my old videos, because I used to be so shy speaking, but I actually saved up my voice a lot for this, to make those videos, so... I hope you like it, I guess. And please subscribe. I know I'm technically bugging now. Um, so I'm gonna tell you guys a story about me and my friend. You might and one of these stories involves two YouTubers, two of my YouTuber friends. Um, I'm gonna tell you one of their channels. One of them hasn't posted in a while, so you might not find a lot of her videos. So basically, this involves Boba Sweet and another YouTuber, which I don't really have permission to mention. So I will not tell you their name. Um, so basically, we were at that YouTube. We were at the YouTuber. Let's call her Shorty because she's the shortest one in our friend group. So basically, we were all just hanging out, chilling. And then one of my friends, Boba Sweet, um, come, I'm just gonna call her Sweet, comes over here and just says, hey, I found this very sharp thing that could most definitely kill one of us any second now. And I was like, cool, not noticing the danger I was in. But then just, and then Shorty starts freaking out. And the other one, we're gonna call her Smarty because she's smart and probably the most responsible one in our entire friend group. And they managed to apprehend, we, I managed to apprehend her and <laughs> take that knife away from her. Um, so basically, we were all just calming down when <laughs> Sweet started having this thing where she was like saying like, I'm gonna attack you. And she did attack us. So like... At least she kept her word about it. But like, <laughs> could you not kill us? I mean like, she kept her word, but could you not kill us? And so all of a sudden, she starts tackling me. And keep in mind, she only tackled me. So I was like, so rude. Like, how could you only tackle me? There's other two girls. There's another two girls here, and of course I didn't want them to get attacked. But still, there's another two girls here, and you decided, out of all of them, that I was gonna be your victim. Real nice there, real nice. So I was like very mad at that moment. I was just like top ten and top ten like anime betrayals at that moment it was basically that but somehow worse um so yeah the story does not end there don't worry so after 
we managed to apprehend her. I apprehend her. I had to apprehend her two times because somehow she managed to find that knife. And we figured out that it could cut. She, we almost got cut that day, almost died. But luckily, we are fine and still alive. Fine and dandy. So don't worry about us. And after that, we were watching some of my videos and her videos. It was very fun, honestly. But so they started calling my videos cringe. And I was like, I know they're cringe, but could you not say it to my face? Um, let's just say that after we started throwing out words, um, one of us, one of us, um, kind of ran away and if you're thinking me no that was not me that was sweet sweet ran away and then i ran away <laughs> i got a quarter of a block away i didn't even cut that far um so i was just basically just walking but then when i was like wait i got nowhere to go <laughs> so i walked back to the house and my friends were just waiting there for me like oh you came back they bribed me with water <laughs> they didn't even bribe me actually i was i just came back on my own i was like hi besties i'm back and so that and so the story does not end there so they managed to get me back first but then they had to get back And honestly, I was, wow. And while they were doing that, I went inside the house. And somehow, I managed to lock them out. I locked my friend out of her own house. It was so dramatic. Like, they couldn't open the door for a good minute. And then I hopped the fence again. And I ran away. Again. I ran away two times, honestly. I don't know how I'm not impressed at this point. Um. So basically, I ran away two times. So, yes. To your girl. Who ran away two times. I didn't even run away from my actual house. I ran away from someone, from someone else's house. So it's not even that impressive. Which I'm not realizing. I should have probably not done. Um, because I probably gave my friend the heart attack. And I feel so bad now. Um, okay, I'm not gonna give her this then. Um, so basically, that's the story of how I ran away. And why I ran away. Basically a very detailed story of how I ran away and locked my friends out. They managed to get in because of course my friend knew how to get in. It was her house. So. And I locked all the doors. So. Sorry. My friend probably didn't want you to know about this. Um, but yeah, I tell the story to everyone I meet. No matter who it is. It's a stranger first time meeting them hey you want to deserve about how i almost killed my best friend <laughs> it's just a funny story i tell i know most people don't find it funny but it was hilarious to me because my friends didn't know but don't remember my friends remember this like very deep detail especially sweet sweet remembers it in so much detail i'm pretty sure she adores that day till now She's gonna despise that day because of me now. I'm proud of myself. Oh, she looks so cute, right? I love how I just go extreme exactly to the part where like, oh my god, she's so cute, right? Immediately. 
after I just started to talk after I just talked about how I almost killed my best friend. But okay, um, should I give her a yellow tint? No, I'm gonna give her like a red tint. Trust me, it's gonna turn out great. I've done it before. It's gonna turn out great. See, I told ya. So let me tell you how my Genshin adventure is going. I'm stuck in a part, in a certain part. And I just can't seem to get out of that part. And I'm very mad now. <laughs> I'm very mad. Um, so basically that's what I've been doing. Have you guys liked the story time? <laughs> Even though it's not really a story time. But I hope you still liked it. Um, let me just finish this off with me actually managing to finish this character. Should I give her a pet? I'm gonna give her Hoshi. Because she's kind of like a shooting star. Um. Oh no. Not this. I didn't even like that. Um. Okay, so give her a name in the comments. Don't care what you name her as long as it's not a bad word or anything insulting. I took a photo. Yay. So bye guys, I'll be shining off. Don't forget to subscribe if you like the channel. Because this is more juicy, crispy content. Don't you just love it? And bye. I'll be signing off now.